Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This year's 40's Garage. On today's episode, we're right back at Project Boxster. I gotta tell you, the interior smells horrible. It's been, I had the top down, obviously the door off for a few days. It just still stinks. So let's give it a quick clean. I'm gonna start off with the front uh, uh, boot and then the rear boot, and then we'll get to the interior. Not sure if I'm gonna take the seats out yet or not. My guess is it's pretty stank. Um, probably want to get those carpets good. So here's a few of the products we're going to be using today. Let's uh, get to it. I'm going to put this on a little time lapse, give you guys some music. No reason to, to watch me in real time clean out the car. All right. <laughs> Good here, let's uh, hit the back boot. All right, rear boot done. Let's go tackle the inside. Okay, let's tackle this interior. First thing I'm gonna do, a little vacuuming, and we'll decide if we're taking these seats out. Um, then maybe just some general dusting. Let's get to it. the other side so I can get that one. Okay, I'm getting some gloves on before I touch this. I think it got all wet in here. I must have been down or something when it first got to auction. So. Uh, yeah, and I'm probably gonna have to hook the battery back up because these are electric seats and I think I'm gonna have to take them out. So let's get some gloves, finish vacuuming this up and then we'll start tearing the seats out. Yeah, it's soaking wet, gross. Good news is it's clean underneath, <laughs> butt wet. Okay, I had to hook the battery back up so I can move the seats. They are electric, which is a plus. I'll, I'll take it. Um, if you guys watch my 996 video when I had the seats redyed, you had to take those out too. So kind of the same story, um, but electric this time. So get the E12 socket. It's uh, this fit right in here. I'm going to break them with this and then we'll take them out with the Milwaukee. Well, this is going to be a fun one. Previous owner or somebody previous broke the uh, connector. So let me uh, let me take a look at this off camera and see what we can do to get her out. Okay, I want to show you what I'm dealing with here. So this connector right here, you're supposed to pull it up. There's supposed to be a piece here to pull it up and then it just kind of pulls it out. It's like the connectors in the back of your dash. Um, YouTube is your friend, people. Uh, use it so you know how to do this stuff. I'm not sure where we're going with this, but let's cut this baby here. Because we can't figure out how to get this apart. Supposed to go like that and then come out, and I'm not seeing it do that. Great. All right. Well, let me get a 
me get a screwdriver and see if we can't pry that open here a little bit or figure out how we get the mechanism to work. YouTube, use it. Helps you do stuff. Okay, got the seat out. So here we are is with this plug. This is the one that had this on here. What it is on the side of the plug here on the other side, you, you pull it out and then it just pops out. Real easy. Two more plugs. This one, they're plugged in underneath here like this and like this. This one, you pull up the center piece, kind of wiggle, 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 comes out. This one, you uh, grab these two ears and pull that out. So we should be all set. So um, <laughs> that's gonna be it for today, guys. I am pooped, I am stinky and smelly, and uh, Mick is coming over and we're going out for dinner. So I will catch you guys later. Uh, if you would, please give me a thumbs up, a like, a subscribe, and uh, we'll see you guys in the next one.